Hey guys, welcome back to this channel. It's Max from the Next Creation. And if it's your first time come across this channel, consider subscribing. By the way, don't forget to click that notification bell. Support this channel by clicking that notification bell. Share it. Put a comment in the comment section. I'll always be getting more than happy to get back to you. And I'll always be very, very happy to get back to you as soon as possible. In today's video, we want to talk about something. I know we are most of you we are planning to change jobs and most of you actually you must have put in your request to change jobs from one job to another which is which is part of which is part of your right to change especially if you finish up your contract in one or the other you can change and move to 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 the new job uh, depending on uh, either you develop uh, after you getting to another level of career or after completing your contract it is mandatory remember Remember before you needed to cho you you there was a lot of kafil where you do not change your job unless you had the permission of your employer, and now that was uplifted and now the great opportunity for all one that all the people that will be either coming to Qatar or coming inside um, Qatar, oh for those jobs that you can change. Yes, now in this opportunity in this video, let us look at people who are already in Qatar. What is the situation right now if you want to change job? That is what we need to understand closely. And that is what we need definitely to understand what is the situation. Before you make a mistake or before I make a mistake, uh, such that at the end of it all, we don't have to regret in one way or the other. The situation right now is all companies to, are not allowing people to change job. Remember, when you put in your request to change the job in the Ministry of Labor in you know, Dalasa, when you apply, a notification will be sent to your employer to alert him your request to change job. So normally what employers are what employers are doing, they are absconding, they reject that request for you to change. Remember, this is a period that we definitely have to talk about and this is a period of the FIFA World Cup. Each company needs all those workers to be there because each company will have different opportunities. That's why when you look at internally, there's a lot of recruitment. We have six months recruitment. We have three months recruitment. Although some people, we were up to now, people who are planned by agents or people who got uh, dubbed up by agents in that country, they've not got the visa. But sincerely, what you need to know is that people or employers are rejecting the change from one job. So meaning that, you need to hold on until FIFA World Cup finishes. When FIFA World Cup finishes, you can change freely. You can change. That means your request will be worked on. But right now, what companies are doing, if you try to change, if you want to insist to change, the company will turn it to there and there, and it will buy you a ticket there and there. And when it buys you a ticket, remember, it will, if, if you don't exit the country, then it will file a case of what you call runaway. Uh, what you call runaway, uh, case against you. So meaning that all the penalties that will accrue, all the penalties will come, will be paid by you as a person. So it is just a humble request. Let us try to be a little bit, let us try to be a little bit patient uh, where we are. I know the conditions may not be good or where you may be not good, you want to change, but we wait for the FIFA World Cup. It's just a few months that we have. Uh, probably you look at it just four months you can persevere with the four months then after four months everything come back to normal then you can change and change quickly as any other person that you can change in one way or the other remember all companies now need all their workers they all need their workers so if you try to insist to change they will definitely have to terminate you to make sure that you go out of the country for good such that you will cannot stay the reason being that there are a lot of companies here recruiting for three months contract and six months contract remember when your visa is cancelled out when you are allowed to change you definitely companies know that you go and work for those companies especially if they may be a competing company which is actually not good and you definitely know there's a lot of recruitment inside here so if you are planning to change it's my humble advice you hold on wait to change until we finish up the world cup then you can change amicably in a very good way hope i've tried to share up something for you Thank you so much for coming back to the channel. It's Max from the next question. And if it's your first time coming to this channel, please support this channel by subscribing. And if you've not pressed the notification bell, please try to press that notification bell. You'll always be updated or you'll always get to those updates when you upload a new video. Thank you so much. See you again in the next video.